Hello everyone, good morning from Japan. Today is Thursday morning, about 8.05 a.m. I want to start this video first giving a big shout out for all the guys from Flatten the Curve. Rob Taylor, John Nicholson, Vika Drazeev, Francis Miller, Brad Freeman, Joshua Silva, Jay and AA, Billy Zig in Australia, Mark Hollander, Kevin Bobbick, and Hector Kenya. Also to David J. Carroll, amazing musician, and all, all the guys behind the documentary, they worked so hard. Let's talk about this amazing new Russian tank, the Armada. I was just watching a couple videos about tanks, and then I, I heard about this one here. So we were, I was reading some information, and this is what I found here. The, the T-14 is a formidable looking beast, armed with a new 125mm main gun and unmanned turret, modular armor and an active protection system designed to shoot down incoming missiles. The vehicle has caused a stir within NATO's tank community. One particularly dangerous feature is the Armada's ability to destroy targets at ranges of up to 12 kilometers or 7.4 miles. So this is one picture of one of the documentaries that I was watching about this tank. See the range? It shoots farther than any other tank ever made at this point. So it's an amazing feature on this tank. Now let's look at the curvature chart and see what we can find out. So as you see, number one, that's the Armada shooting down another tank. Picture number two, also the same Armada should trying to shoot down another tank. So if you calculate the curvature in 7.5 miles or 12 kilometers, that's what you see in illustration number two. The tank would never shoot the target because the target would be hidden behind the curvature, about 13.5 feet of curvature, around 4.11 meters. Okay, 4 meters and 11 centimeters. So, just for you to have an idea, if the Armada, the new Russian tank Armada, was trying to shoot down a, an American tank, the Abrams, the Abrams, the Height of the Abrams is 8 feet, about 2 meters and 44 centimeters. So that would make the, the that would be impossible for the Amada to shoot down this tank because the tank would be hidden behind 4 meters of curvature, about 13 feet, 13 and a half feet. So if the Abrams is only 8 feet high, the Abrams would be hidden behind the curvature of the Earth. But since there is no curvature, they wouldn't make a tank able to shoot down a target at 7.5 miles, 12 kilometers, if Earth had any curvature at all. They wouldn't be making that because there would be no point. But the reason they make a tank that can shoot down a target at 7.5 miles away is because there is no curvature of the Earth and neither is pink. So that's all for today, guys. A big shout out for everybody. I also have now a Brazilian channel. I've opened a, a Brazilian channel. And I would ask you if you know someone who speaks Portuguese. Or, you know, if you just want to practice Portuguese. That's my new channel. I'm going to leave the link down below. And, you know, I just only have 60 subscribers there. So if you want to help out and subscribe but all the contents uh, in that channel will be in Portuguese I have already added uh, uploaded I have already uploaded a couple of contents there so if you can or if you know anybody who speaks Portuguese please sign uh, and subscribe to that channel thanks guys one more time see you the next time take care bye bye